Today, we're gonna learn some common phrases you can use in a restaurant. Let's get started. How big is your party? Okay, so when you enter the restaurant, the host may ask you, how big is your party? That just means, how big is your group? So if you have a group of two people, you would say, we have a party of two. Or if you have four people, you would say, we have a party of four. Or, for example, if I have a party of six, and I'm waiting for a table, and it's my turn, then the host will call out and say, Nick, party of six. Ordering. So, as soon as you sit down at your table, your server will immediately ask you, can I get you anything to start? All right, can I get you anything to start? Or can I get you anything to drink? Can I get you anything to drink? Both of these mean the same thing. They are just asking if you'd like to have anything to drink so they can go get your drinks while you look at the menu and decide what you want to order. So common ways to respond are, can I get a, uh, can I get a chocolate milk? I'll have a, I'll have a chocolate milk or I'll take a, obviously you don't have to order chocolate milk. You can get whatever you want, but if you do order chocolate milk, so, when your server returns with your drinks, they will then ask for your food order. And they will probably use one of these phrases. What can I get you? Alright, what can I get you? What would you like? Okay, what would you like? Or, what can I start you off with? Alright, what can I start you off with? Then, you can respond with one of these phrases. Can I get a... Can I get a mac and cheese? I would like to have a... Mm, I'll have the mac and cheese. I'll take a... Uh, I'll take a mac and cheese. Oh man, I would kill for some mac and cheese right now. Mm. Calling your server. Okay, calling your server. So, if you ever need to get your server's attention, maybe you need some more plates, maybe you would like some more water, anything. If you need their attention, I always like to start with, excuse me, Oh, uh, excuse me, uh, can I get some more napkins, please? Thanks. Or, when you get a chance, oh, uh, when you get a chance, can I get five more chocolate milks? Thanks. These are some of the same phrases that you would use at a bar if you're ordering drinks. If you want to see my video on how to order drinks at a bar, check it out right there. Finding a bathroom. Okay, in English, there are tons of ways you can say bathroom. Loo, water closet, washroom, the list goes on. But in America, the most common ways to say bathroom are bathroom and also restroom. So you would say, where is the bathroom? Where's the bathroom? Where's the restroom? Or you can also ask, do you have a restroom I can use? Or do you have a bathroom I can use? Okay, so now at the very end of the meal, when you are all done eating and you are so full, your stomach is about to burst, you just flag oh, down your server me. and ask them, uh, can I get the check when you get a chance? Excuse me, can I have the bill? Okay, tipping. In the US, it is customary to tip your server 15 to 20%, but if your party is larger than six, they may automatically include tip or gratuity. So make sure you check so you don't tip them twice. And if you're not sure, you can always ask your server, is tip included, is gratuity included? But this is only for parties of six or larger. All right, so you're finished eating and you've eaten as much as you could, but maybe your eyes were bigger than your stomach and you ordered way too much food. If you'd like to take the leftover food home, you can stop and ask your server, Excuse me, can I have a doggy bag or can I get a box? In the 1970s, the term doggy bag was used to promote bringing your leftover food home to your pet. But now we just use it as a general term to mean tapao. All right, so when you're ready to leave, after you've eaten and you've paid the bill and you've got your doggy bag, you just simply say thank you to your server and the host and waltz out of the restaurant. Hooray, you've completed your first colloquial English dining experience. We went over a ton of phrases today, so I suggest that you write down the phrases in this video, re-watch the video so that you can get some more practice, 
And then next time when you're in the restaurant, you can practice these phrases with your server. If you have any questions or you want to make any comments, just drop me a line below or send me a message and I will get back to you as quickly as I can. Now, time to go find some chocolate milk. <laughs>